when selling your home, statistical research has found that the best realtors helping you sell the home are worth more than they cost, unless you are a seasoned pro. Now, for instance, in an area where the realtor charges 6% on a $100,000 home, that's a $6,000 commission. So you want to put a, a, a for sale by owner sign in the front yard and save the realtor's fees. Now, I'm big on saving money, and I'm big on not paying for something that doesn't justify itself. So I, I'm huge as a consumer advocate on that. But what we in the real estate business have found over the years, and I don't sell real estate for a living now, so it's okay. If it was different, I would tell you, all right, that that for sale by owner sign says something to a buyer. Now think like a buyer for a minute. If you're going to walk up and try to buy from that for sale by owner, one thing that's running through your mind is, I'll get this cheaper because they don't have to pay a... Now, you can't both save the same realtor's fee, okay? I can't sell you the house for 100 and you save the realtor's fee and buy it for 94 And so what ends up happening is we both negotiate through and the buyer ends up getting part of the realtor's fee. And so what happens is, you know, maybe 3,000 of the 6,000 I end up giving away because of a FISBO and because I'm negotiating face-to-face -face with you without a third-party intermediary between, which is always a much stronger negotiating position to have someone else that can good guy, bad guy a little bit back and forth and keep this thing rolling, right? Now, that and also uh, people who sell four houses or five houses or seven houses in their lifetime tend to make mistakes the people that sell 30 and 40 and 50 houses a year don't make in the transaction process, in the negotiating of the contract. Actual mistakes in what the real value of the house is what points are, how to do all of these different things with the closing attorney, what to expect when you get to the table so there are no surprises. A realtor brings all these things to the table, and by the time you really don't save the whole commission, the realtor sells the house faster because they have access to marketing tools that the public does not have access to, like the MLS, the multiple listing service. By the time they sell it faster, more likely to sell it and make fewer mistakes and don't have to negotiate away part of that commission, you end up actually making more on a good quality realtor than they cost you. So I recommend you get an excellent realtor. 